friends, this is Wolfgang with Tools for Ascension and today's short video is about um, quick psychic self-defense and as you're waking up now uh, to a higher spirituality, you become aware more of your body and of the force field around your body, so so many of you, you know, suddenly may feel uh, something attaching to the sides of their head or to their neck or other areas of their body. Um, like secondary or primary sexual organs, for instance. Uh, and uh, so some kind of a subtle astral uh, groping. And we know this is not an accident or a nervous twitter. So what to do? And I show you three ways, three easy ways on what to do. Um, let's say when you by yourself and you notice there's anybody coming into your force field, something ominous, Right? You know, there is a dirty trick, very easy, everybody can do this. And you clap your hands, you know, three times. And, uh, you know, this shock wave that is uh, created through this clapping, and, you know, the louder you do it, <laughs> you know, the better, uh, uh, creates a shock wave, like a cracker. Um, that they use like in, in Chinese New Year's and other festivals, you know, it it's not only scares the ghost away, it creates a shock wave on the astral plane and it hurts them. It's like getting kicked in the gut, <laughs> you know, so um, it's just uh, uh, something that's very unpleasant to them, right? Uh, of course, you know, a conch shell or a big gong, you know, would do good, or gunshot or firecracker. So, but, you know, clapping your hands is very, very annoying to them. Mm -hmm. Of course, you know, we cannot always do that. Uh, and uh, so uh, another uh, nice way is just basically uh, to just uh, grab that area and just rub it. You know, so you notice there's something, you know, you rub it as if it got stung by a mosquito, and then maybe try to actually imagine you grab it and just flick it off. You know, and you can do this three times, four times, you know, or when you like with people, you just go, you know, so that nobody sees this, but do not flick this on somebody else. I got flicked <laughs> like that once, and I mean, it took me half an hour to get that uh, bad mood or that entity out of me, uh, but that was long ago. Uh, <clears throat> so just, you know, taking it, rubbing it, and, you know, picking it up and intending to throw it away, and, you know, don't come back. <laughs> I command you in the name of source. Right? Uh, this uh, might work, also very simple to do. Now a more advanced uh, way is where you actually scrub it with light. Uh, in some other videos I show you how to scrub, you know, the pineal gland and the third eye, <laughs> you know. Uh, this chi just go back and forth and now similarly uh, just imagine, you know, basically you have a source of love from the heavens and uh, from the earth mother and you just, you know, create a column, maybe a little rod of light and then just go back and forth, you know, to, to wherever, you know, it's hurting, basically you're scrubbing with the chi and connected with your breath and the visualization and the intent. And the more you smile, you know, the more potent it is, uh -huh. the sweeter, you know, the better. Uh, the, the dog just hates love, <laughs> right? You just tell them how pretty they are and how sweet they are and how much you love their services. Uh -huh. So, uh, yeah, you just uh, keep scrubbing it and until it feels better. You know, and uh, you know, chi up, that's always a good defense and ask for help. And uh, these are three easy ways uh, of uh, defending against little intrusions. Uh, and of course, the last one is the way you can do in public because nobody knows what you're doing unless maybe you smile like an idiot. Right? I love you and namaste. And I do private sessions. See you. <laughs>